This video will demonstrate the proper procedure for setting up and using the Kato Prewinder Hand Installation Tool. Let's begin by reviewing each component. This is the Prewinder Sleeve. In the back of the sleeve is a threaded collar, and towards the front are the Prewinder threads. This is the threaded mandrel. The Tangless Prewinder Hand Tool also includes a pawl, spring, and pin inside the mandrel. The plastic handle is connected to the back of the mandrel. Notice how the mandrel freely slides inside the prewinder sleeve. This is the depth adjusting collar. Inside is a set screw to secure the collar in place. Use an Allen wrench to tighten or loosen the set screw. Now we'll demonstrate how to set the correct installation depth using the Tangless installation tool. The procedure is the same for Tanged. Loosen the depth adjusting collar using an Allen wrench. Then slide the mandrel all the way through the prewinder sleeve. This will expose all the threads on the tip of the mandrel. Thread the insert all the way onto the mandrel until it stops. Next, use the collar to slide the prewinder sleeve upward until it is about one thread behind the last coil. Use the Allen wrench to tighten the set screw. With the insulation depth now set, we are ready to install an insert. Slide the mandrel back into the prewinder sleeve. Drop the insert into the well. Because we are using tangless, we don't need to orient the insert. It's bi-directional. For tang, drop the insert into the well so that the tang is facing forward. Now, slide the mandrel forward until it reaches the insert. And then turn clockwise. Continue to turn the mandrel. The paw will grab the insert and begin to thread it through the prewinder. Once the mandrel starts to exit the prewinder, hold the tool perpendicular to the hole so that it is straight. Avoid holding it at an angle and avoid wobbling during installation. This could cause the installation to fail and may damage the installation tool. Continue to turn the mandrel clockwise. Once the insert is fully installed, the collar will come into contact with the prewinder sleeve. Rotate the mandrel counterclockwise until it completely exits the installed insert. Check the installation depth and readjust if necessary. For holes with a countersink, you'll want to be 3 quarters to 1 and a half threads below the surface. As you can see, the Kato Prewinder Hand Tool is really easy to set up and very simple to use. It's ideal for low volume, manual installation of Kato coil thread inserts. In fact, Kato strongly recommends using a Prewinder style hand tool for all manual installations. Thank you for watching the Kato Prewinder Hand Tool video.